Hey guys, it's Matt from TotalMGG here, and it's Deck Tech Tuesday. So, without further ado, let's have a look at our little deck today. It is a red black devoid standard deck, or Rakdos devoid. So, we're going to start off by looking at the creatures. We run, they're all devoid, all the creatures, as far as I know. I just put this together. Uh, it's four sludge crawlers, which is a 1 1 for 1. Uh, but you can pay two and get pump it, give it plus one one to end a turn. It's devoid and it's got ingest as well. That's a lot of the um, devoid creatures have ingest, which is pretty nice. And then we go on to slaughter drone. Uh, run four of these. Run four of all the creatures that we're running. Um, slaughter drone is a two two. You can pay a colorless, and it will gain death touch to end of turn, which is pretty sweet. So we run them. Um, four runner slaughter, so red and a black, 3 2 for 2. This is really good card. Um, you can pay one and give a colourless creature a haste to end a turn, and all our creatures are colourless because they're all devoid. So we're going to run a play set of them. Uh, flyer drone, red black one, it's a flyer. Uh, when another colourless enters the battlefield under your control, target opponent loses one life. So you can see it's, you know, it's got some nice synergy so far. And, um, you know, a little bit aggro. This is hopefully one of our bigger beaters. Uh, it's the Vile Aggregate being used a lot in, I've seen it, you've obviously seen it in Modern as well. And uh, the Mono Red Aldrazi, I think, runs it as well. Uh, its, power and tough, its power is equal to the number of colours creatures. And since we're all colours creatures, Vile Aggregate could be a very big, you know, hopefully a 10-5 or something silly like that. would be brilliant as our little beater. Um, next card I'm going to try. It was between this... In the sideboard I do have... Um, oh, I've obviously got... I think it's Eldrazi Obli Obliterator, whatever it's called. Um, Eldrazi Oblig... I oh, can't speak today. Ob Obligator. That's the word I'm trying to get out. Jesus, I really struggled to get that one out today. Um, I'm going to try Dominator Drone in the main board. Um, it was a toss-up between this and the Obligator. But I want to give this one a try. You know, it's, it's, it's nearly... It's not a budget deck, but it is a fun deck. Um, it has got a couple of like, you know, in the lands, Bloodstained Mire, obviously they're not really budget, and it's got Colligan's Commands as well in the in the um, main deck, which obviously isn't very budget as well. But overall, you know, the deck is not, you know, you can find substitutes, and the deck is not really, really expensive. And then, oh, it was three of these, not four, sorry, Dust Stalker. Um, cost two, a black and a red, it's a 5-3 with haste. Um, at the beginning of each end step, if you control no other colours creatures, you return this to his hand. But obviously it's got haste, so you can put it back down and attack in again. So, guys, those were the creatures. So let's go on to the spells. We have a four wild slash. Nice little early kill creature. You know, does two damage to target creature or player. Very good card, wild slash. Then we run three grasp of darkness. Um, target creature gets minus four, minus four. Costs double black. Which is going to hit, you know, quite a few creatures. And then we run the three Colligan's Command. Colligan's Command is an absolutely brilliant card. One, a black and a red. Um, you choose two options. You can return target creature card from your graveyard to your hand. They can discard a card, target opponent. Destroy an artifact or do two damage to creature or player. So, yet yeah, again, we can hit to the head. Like the Wild Slashes. Um, as for the land base in the deck... We're running some swamps, you know. I'll put the deck list in the... Um, description below so you guys can all have a look um, and you know save going back and seeing what I put down uh, Bloodstained Myers we run four of them like I say you know this it's not very they're obviously not budget at all at the moment but they will be rotating out soon anyway but this deck you know it's not it's it's got a few cards like the Colligan's Commands and the Bloodstained Myers that are, obviously won't last rotation but it's pretty much on point at the moment to last just need a few changes uh, Corrupted Crossroads, another land, um, you can tap for the colourless, which is good to get the, um, the creature with the Death Touch. And you can pay one life to um, spend this mana only on cast a spell of the Devoid, but it lets you add a mana of any colour, which is good for us as well. So around four of them, then some mountains, and then four Smouldering Marsh as well. So, you can see the deck at the moment. It's basically, you know, we've got early creatures, we've got aggro really, um, we've got the big haste guy at the end, and we've got the um, vile aggregate as well, which is... Obviously, you know, hopefully a big beater for us, as long as we've got loads of the little creatures in, in tow. 
Um, four run of slaughter as well gives our creatures haste, which is nice. Um, let me know whether you, you know, I'm going to show you onto the sideboard now. Um, I do like Dot. I want to give Dominator Drone a go because it, you know, puts pressure on with the life as well, and it's obviously ingest. But maybe, maybe the obligator should be main board. So, you know, let me know what you think in the comments. So we do have four of these in the sideboard at the moment. It um, has haste, and you can pay one of the colours to gain control of target creature and so then that will gain haste. So, you know, it's pr it's pretty good, but obviously you've got to have the colourless land to play it. Um, we could possibly change the land a bit, and if we, you know, if we're going to put these main board, maybe put a couple of wastes in. But we do run the crossroads as well, which does tap for colourless. A um, couple of self-inflicted wounds. We've got green-white decks out at the moment. Um, roasts. Five damage to a lot of creatures. You know, five five power is going to kill a lot of creatures. You know, if they've got if they've got five toughness, we will be able to... Sorry, five toughness, sorry. As long as they haven't got flying, we will be able to, you know, kill them. Obviously, you not get the, the big Eldrazi ones at the moment. But we have some rending volleys as well, which does white and blue creatures. A um, couple of murderous cuts. To deal with some, you know, slightly larger creatures that we might come up against. And just going to try a one of Rolling Thunder in the sideboard. Uh, deals X damage divided as you choose against any number of target creatures and or players. So it could be like a little finisher to the head. Or token decks. We can sort of clear the field, hopefully, with that. So, you know, this is the Red Black Rakdos Devoid deck. Um, can't remember one of the guys um, commented, uh, one of our subscribers commented and said, "Could you make a red black divorce?" I hope he's watching this. Um, yeah, I mean, it's it's a fun deck. It's not going to be the most strongest deck in the world, but you know, it's it's near on budget. You can, like I said, you will be able to make changes for the bloodstained miles. Obviously, bloodstained miles make make the deck good because it thins your deck out, gets you the land you want. But if you haven't got them and the colleagues command, you, you know, just make a couple of little changes, and the basis of the deck will still be there. So, you know, it's a fun standard deck and it, you know, it's basically nearly going to last when the, when the, um, when we have our next rotation in standards. Um, you know, hopefully I'll get this, get this on camera very soon and we can test it out maybe against one of the guys, see how it fares. Anyway guys, I hope you like this deck for Deck Tech Tuesday, Rakdos Devoid. Um, please leave a like and subscribe guys and have a look at all our other deck techs, go and have a look at the playlists. Um, I will also this week be announcing the winner of our 100th video giveaway, so keep a watch out for that. Anyway guys, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next week. Cheers guys!